WTFNN. Headline news update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. It's Friday, 10 a.m. Eastern Time. Jobs Friday at that. Quite a number. Jobs number coming in for the month of May. 75,000 jobs added. There was a revision for previous jobs number taking away 75,000. So really a net zero. Market reacting to that. We got markets positive expectations are rate cut rate cuts are coming down the line dow jones up 203 points trading 25,924 s&p is currently positive 24 points trading at 2867 the nasdaq up more than a full percent up 83 points trading at 7700 on the dot and the russell up about half a percent up about eight points at 1511 as we start things off this morning Excuse me, taking a look at the volatility index, as you would expect, positive market, a little bit of volatility around that jobs number. We reached 1533. You have the VIX trading 1596. Start things off, we're going to start it off with that jobs report. Jobs report slows dramatically. Expectation had been about 175,000. We get 75,000 in May, not what the market expected. All expectations point to the fact that lower rates coming at us. With that in mind, 10 year Treasury dropping below 2.0. 06, lowest level since September of 2017. Market pricing in that rate cut, those rate cuts, plural, maybe coming down the line. So we'll jump back to the charts. We'll start it off with the Dow. And there's your acceleration as the market figures out, hey, we got a bad jobs number. We got rate cuts coming down the line. Market climbs higher. We trade from 25,750. We're now a solid 200 points above that level, trading 25,940. NASDAQ 100, similar action. Currently trading at 73.77. We were down there at 72.87. So you're talking about 90 points in the last hour and a half. S&P is trading at 26.68. Lows just after that jobs number of 28.46. You're talking about 22 S&P points. Crude oil bouncing around, made it up to a high pre-market of 53.82. Was down there at 52.63. Crude trading at 53.35. Gold with some volatility on that number as well. Gold almost made it to 1350, reached a high of 1349.47, currently trading 1345. And uh, dollar, dollar pulling back on that news, euro accelerating higher, euro above 113, 113.18. And as we wrap up, Beyond Meat last night, how about it? Earnings up 23%, the stock going public at 25. Stay tuned. Come back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Live programming all market day at TFNN. Have a great Friday, everybody.